Moving on to our next category, which is a really exciting category. It is the Outstanding Performance category, which is de dedicated to celebrating and recognizing those whose performances have really left an impact. And here to present this award is an actor whose career has done just that. From the early days starring in The Mummy through to Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets and an unforgettable performance in Mission Impossible Rogue Nation, please give a warm welcome to the incredibly talented Sean Cronin. Well, here's Johnny again. How you doing? So, thank you, Louise. It's an absolute pleasure to be here among such remarkable talent. Uh, the ninth, the ninth, don't forget that, it's the ninth annual National Film Awards. The question arises, to be a villain or not to be a villain? That is the question. So last year when I came here, I'd, I, um, I'd been in 79 movies. I died in 75, never to be in the fucking sequel ever. But now I've died in 89, I've been in 89 movies and I've died in 85, so I'm trying for 100. But one thing that I would say, guys, making a movie is fucking hard work, it's difficult. This is the glamorous bit, but to actually get to the point where you get a movie over the line is an incredible achievement. So anyone here that's been nominated for best actor, best whatever, best you know, director, best producer, it's a journey. Sometimes you, you, know, you watch a movie, you nod off. Don't nod off. It's taken 100 people 10 years to make that fucking movie. Stay awake. Okay. Yes, yeah, stay awake. However, so tonight we celebrate the nominees who have achieved the most outstanding performance. And the nominees for most outstanding performance are... Outstanding performance, 2023. Keanu Reeves, John Wick. I'm going to die. Maybe not. Goodbye to you. Cynthia Erivo, Drift. What do you have? Anya Taylor-Joy, The Menu. You know what I'd really like? Tell me. A cheeseburger. We mean no one. Hugh Grant, Hussein, Operation Fortune, Roosdegar. Mr. Escobar, and that's before I start dropping names. <laughs> Why none of them have ever refused to India Amatafio, Queen Charlotte, A Bridgerton Story. Well, none of us are anyone. Swipe on the icon. Bally like Jill, Alleluia. With greater gentleness, as though you've seen a speck of dust and wish to brush it away. <gasps> Adele James, you. Queen Cleopatra. What would you die for? I am Isis. I am a god. As long as she's alive, she is the pharaoh. My father's war. Daniel Radcliffe, oh, Weird, oh, the AI, Yankovic story. Hungry one. Hungry one. Open up a package of my banana. Nervous. Stephen Merchant, time. The Outlaws. Not sexually, I mean with a prostitute, with, with a lady of ill repute. Well, Millie Bobby papers. Brown, Enola Holmes too. And the winner is this young lady. This young lady, I did a showreel acting course with seven years ago, and she stood out in that course as one of the most amazing breakthrough talents. I knew, I knew this girl was going to be a star. And the winner is Adele James! Yeah! Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, 
Um, my agent just said to me, did you prepare anything to say? And I was like, nope. <laughs> Have you seen the list of people? <laughs> um, wow, thank you so much. Um, what an incredible honor. And you know, I feel like the only thing I can really say here and now is there are a lot of black and brown people in this room and my guess is that most of you will have probably seen and heard what happened when this show was announced um, and the way that some people in the world responded to it and my guess is that you will either know what that feels like or potentially have to go through it yourself. And all I can say is you are amazing um, you work so hard to do what you do. I work so hard on that job. Everybody works so hard on that job. We all work so hard to do what we do. And just keep walking in your power. Just keep making art that means something to you. Thank you so much for this. What an honor. <laughs> Amazing. A round of applause for Adele.